for players and fans alike. Few schools can match a game day experience at Ohio State. The pep rally atmosphere of the skull session at St. John Arena a few hours before the game, followed by the team walk to Ohio Stadium through some of college football's most passionate and adoring fans. Head coach Urban Meyer addressing every one of his players as they head to their locker room. Along with Lamon DeMont, Vice. And it is taken at the goal line and stacked up and nailed. Delay of game. Offense. And a delay of game. Five yard penalty. So tough First down. to send the late 70s. Here's a handoff to Albert, and Albert is stacked 79, 16 to 13. Damian Fleming up top, top of your screen. Washington is out as that passes, and Ohio State should start out with great field position as this one is blocked. It is blocked, and it sails out of bounds. Randy was able to get a piece of it. Well, I'm going to just tell you, that's... The punter Blanton to shank it. Here's Guyton. Guyton connecting right down the sideline is Evan Spencer. Spencer had one catch last week. However, he rated out as one of their best wide receivers because of his blocking last week in Berkeley. Well, if you don't block in this offense, you don't play. And quickly, Hall is the running back. Guyton sends it to his tight end, Jeff Hireman. Hireman inside the five. John Ajo is there. Ojo comes in, the four-year starter, grad student. And they are moving quickly here as Guyton rolls to the near side, looking to the end zone, floats it out there, and it is intercepted by Florida A&M and brought out of the ball is loose on the turf. Patrick Aiken with the interception, and then it's fumbled and recovered by the Buckeyes. Oh, my goodness. A challenge and you see how he lost the ball Patrick Aiken did out of the shotgun Guyton hands it off Hall straight up the middle they have four plays all of them passing and the Hall comes in Buckeyes on the board it's a second series in fact and that one is out of bounds a quarterback out of the shotgun Fleming with time fires to the near side for the Rattlers to come in here against one of the best teams in the country is this one Grambling and Grambling was unable to work is not here Colby Bryant his first punt 15 yards and that one taken back by Brown inside the 15 and brought out at the 30 here he is at the 40 cuts it back inside the Rattler territory across the field at the 42 Philly Brown racing and shoved out of bounds at the 21 by the punter, Colby Blanton. During the return, personal foul, Florida a &M. Half the distance to the goal line. Ohio State keeps the ball first down. He fields the ball, and then he lets the block set up. You see how he juked inside and went back outside? That's to set the defenders up so these guys can make the blocks, and he's off to the races. At the 11-yard line as Philly Brown would have 25 yards. Guyton with plenty of time. Fires and lowering the left shoulder is Jeff Hireman. The tight end already with two catches. And Hireman. And here's Guyton to Hall. Hall brought back to the 10 two-point conversion for Ohio State but the Buckeye Basil to kick it off Vice is back along with Owens and this one taken at the one and bringing it all the way back up as he Fleming on a handoff trying to get outside is Omari Alves good athletic ability good players and a whistle is down. Joey Bosa, 97, the true freshman from Fort Lauderdale. Offense, number 70. Five-yard penalty. It remains second down. Fleming fires, and it's batted down. 
They put those big arms up. Awful hard concerned about the tackling and all the missed tackles last week at Cal. Fleming under pressure out of the pocket, looking downfield, running out of time. And he finds a reach to five yards. Here's Colby Blanton. Blanton, this one is blocked and scooped back up by Blanton. As you see right here, they got the first one. They came, it was a semi poor snap block. The man coming off the corner, the hunter's going to walk that way. A series, an 11 yard strike to Hireman is tight end. This time, finds Hireman once again. Hireman spinning around, and he is. Here's Guyton. Guyton with all the time of the world fires to the end zone. What a great catch by Evan Spencer in the back of the end zone. The Buckeyes continue to roll here in the opening from Kenny Guyton. Big Ten offensive player, second career start as Braxton Miller, who is in, still waiting for his return, more than likely next week against Wisconsin. 20. Now Tariq McBurse is back, along with Owens, and cutting it back up to the near side. Backfield, and another whistle, and flags are down. They're really having trouble. All start. Offense, yep. number 55. Five-yard penalty. Still first down. In Columbus, to see where you are as a player. Because you're going to play FNA Florida A&M football. <laughs> Fleming. Fires underneath in the pass against Tennessee State. They have struggled mightily on offense. Blanton, this one angling, and early in that game on September 7th, and second down, Guyton with time, fires to Spencer, and see Carlos Hyde. He has been suspended the last three weeks, and the catch is made by Philly Brown for a first down. That cow. You can only imagine the day that he's going to get Football Foundation Offensive Player of the Week. Guyton looks downfield. Rod Smith and a nice first year. Ironman once again. Rod Smith is a running back. Guyton on an option gives it to Smith. Smith is going to be corralled and brought down on depth chart but he's not the third best running back is the running back stays in to block provides Guyton some room and Guyton fires the play of game offense five yard penalty still first down 14 in the red zone Guyton fires and the pass Guyton underneath to Wilson the true freshman looking for space, dancing around and down. Guyton with plenty of time to the end zone for it here. And understandably so. Guyton fires underneath. And two running plays. Guyton, he can run here if he wants to. Instead, he fires. Pass interference. Defense, number four. Half the distance to the goal line. Automatic first down. Throw down the goal line. Carlos Hyde, and there's the pitch, and a touchdown for the Buckeyes. Well, the extra point, and it's good. And from the third best team in the land, you would expect a first. Basil to kick it off. Owens takes it at the three. Owens pass at 15, pass at 20, 25, and five. Weiss in the backfield. Here's Fleming under pressure. Joey Bosa was right there. This pass is picked off and heading down the sideline. Bradley Roby. Roby shoved. Damian Fleming, the quarterback, he just throwing that ball. I don't know if he's trying to throw it out of bounds or no way could he have seen the receiver. If you're going to throw it out of bounds, you got to throw it up to row 10. Guyton with time to the end zone. Touchdown, Buckeyes, as Devin Smith reels it in with Patrick Aiken there. Ohio State put up 52 last 144 yards, four touchdowns. A rain-filled morning. 
And this one taken by McBurst right at the goal line. He'll bring it out. And there's a flag down to McBurst. Tackled from behind. And another flag is down here. During the return, holding return team number six at the distance of the goal line. Florida and keeps the ball first down. Fleming fires it up top out on an island. Quarterback Omari Albert, the running back. And stacked up. Got to care, take care of his team first. Damian Fleming under pressure, wrapped up and brought down from his end zone. Colby Blanton. And this one, bounces personality in the makeup of the young man. Jordan Hall cuts it back up, spins away from one would-be tackler, and now give it to him, though. <laughs> Here's Guyton. Guyton fires underneath to his tight end. Heading back, Guyton on a handoff and an excellent job by the Last week on his second throw of the game, this one is on third and 12. Guyton looks downfield, steps up, fires over the middle in the pass. Holding, defense, yep. number four, 10-yard penalty, automatic first down. Handoff, here's Hall. Hall running toward the end zone, touchdown Buckeyes. 40 to nothing. Basil comes on, it's now. Everything you expected coming into this game. As is Bice Goff. And this one sent through the end zone. Rattlers without a first down. And this pass is collected and caught by Felix. Fleming and a handoff. And he was close to being shown the door if he didn't commit to it. Under pressure, Fleming fires to the high side. Fields is back for Ohio State. And he's waving around his first game back after three-game suspension. The running back, and he will get it once again, spinning away from Guyton. Guyton with all the time he needs now out of the pocket. He's going to run for it. But he graded out high, and part of the main reasons, the wide receivers. Big run here by Carl. He said about the defense, he said, it's not what I expect. Here's Hyde once again. Hyde bounces out off of the would-be tackler. Now inside the 20 with a great run. Carlos Hyde's a little bigger now. He's six foot, 235. He's got those big legs, and he gives that power run up the middle. And off. Here's Smith straight ahead. Right up. Fired. Guyton. With time. Guyton to the end zone. Touchdown, Buckeyes, once again, as Chris Fields reels it in. Nine different Buckeye receivers. As Guyton now. Kind of expected that. Remember, you have the defending Big Ten champs in Wisconsin next week, and really the mindset to get 24 yards. Well, Miller just an outstanding job. He's only awesome, doesn't it? I mean, it's just. Omari, Albert Woody Hayes, your former head coach, and of course you worked for him. And, uh, B to the near side of the pass is caught by McBurst. McBurst, the trench, I think a 73 year at Allegheny College. Or is it Ball State? Michigan, another chance. Goldie Blanton back to Chris Fields. Fields takes it at the seven. Fields looking for a seam. 10 10 tie. Hand off to Rod Smith. Rod Smith with room. Pass to 30, 35, and five. Yes, and if you're Ohio State, you love the history, and if you're Guyton, with time, fires to the near side, and the pass is play. Guyton on a handoff, Rod Smith, cuts to the outside, Smith now back, cuts into the inside, and Guyton has connected with nine different receivers, Guyton. Fires underneath to Wilson, and that's six deep at running back. Guyton making time for himself, and he five wide receivers. Here's Guyton. Guyton looks downfield, fires. Guyton with time, pump fakes, now fires wide open. 
Griffin. Touchdown for the Buckeyes, Evan Spencer. Guyton with it, looking for a record. He's got it. it. Led the Buckeyes offense to a three-year best, 608 yards. Five, nothing. Offense, number 55. Five-yard penalty, still first down. They have to get out of the game because of a big payday. Easier to sit down. Yes, McBurst. Second half underway. Getting better or you're getting worse, you don't stay the same. Cardale Jones. At a Glendale High School. Have to. It's a must. Ezekiel Elliott is a running back. Straight ahead. Bounces outside and Elliott into Rattler. Hand off once again to Elliott. El As a quarterback, starting quarterback. And the number of players that are coming out of that program is just unbelievable. Straight up the middle. Jones. Coming the other way, Jones trying to stay on his feet. And he 28th in the FBS in total offense, fourth in the big chat. Here's Jones. Jones looking for some help, picking up a block. Jones down at the 20 yard line. Ohio State entering this game 44.7 and a handoff. Getting outside is Elliott stretched there. Handoff, Elliott bounces outside. A touchdown, the true freshman from St. Louis, Missouri, Ezekiel Elliott. His first career touchdown for the Buckeyes. The extra point is good. Good. Kyle Clinton to kick off. They beat USC in the Rose Bowl. Accomplish anything great unless you learn to work together as a team. Damian Fleming going deep down the some of the guys. Uh, there's some guys you said, is that that's such and such? So it, it, it's been a lot. When you go out there and beat a great USC team. One quick Braxton Miller question for you, Cornelius. He's 13 yards away from breaking your record. He could light up a room. And when you sit around and talk football with him, all the great stories. And... On a handoff, Albert. <laughs> Oh, what a tremendous story. And I couldn't believe he was singing the song. When end over end, Fields waving everybody away from it as this one's going to take. Guyton back in and a handoff to Elliott, and Elliott spinning. On a handoff, ball, ball straight ahead. Hayes in 1978 on an inside handoff. A great run by Ball from Woody Hayes to come back to Ohio State. Getting to the outside is Elliott. Elliott with room. Elliott at the 25-20. Elliott caught from behind. Says the competition at running back. They have no problems in practice. They have a lot of talent. These guys are fighting. Gains in the game. Here's Elliott straight ahead. Bounces outside. Elliott is second touchdown. Holding offense number 33. 10-yard penalty. It's still first down. Elliott on a handoff straight ahead. Handoff now getting outside. Here's Elliott. Elliott into the end zone. No flags. Today was going to be a tough one. For his Rattlers. And George Jump, he said, tell him, he says, that's where they raised the flag on Iwo Jima. He looked at me and said, don't you ever forget it. He got me. He certainly did as Patrick Aiken. Not my coaching life. Carson Royal is a new quarterback. McBurst trying to bounce it outside. Trying to get outside his vice. And remember, no Adolphus Washington. Out for the second consecutive week. Wrapped up and brought down. Fair. Blanton. The kick. Spiraling. And taken at the 35. Fields looking for some room at a wrap. In the Big Ten. An inside handoff. 69 to nothing as we enter the fourth quarter. With the lead, Guyton on a handoff. He didn't get off to the right foot with Urban Meyer, and now he's one of his favorite players. Ball, Warren Ball turned. Terry Johnson is back for the Rattlers. 
end over end fair catch and it was just always great and they formed a great bond and of course still friends street of the Rattlers with a Mike Vrabel and he he would throw out a player will take the direct snap and looking for the run a little bit of wildcat here at Ohio State goes from Ohio State to throw football he had, I forget how many interception was unbelievable and how car accident this past Tuesday Jones is back in at quarterback and Elliott straight through now for the Buckeyes and Elliott getting to the outside Elliott and holding yeah. offense number eight half the distance to the goal line second down and then also from an offensive standpoint you know they're going to be sharp you know that urban in the entire history of this storied program and now you're down here today and they stay on the ground as you would expect Elliott runs through one rattler now at the 30 up and a handoff to ball ball Ohio State under coach Hayes getting to the outside and Rudy Hubbard was an assistant coach for six years here, including the Columbus. And he said it's just a mix of emotions. Obviously, has ties here on both sides. But to be a part of the ground, Jones gives it to Ball. Ball looking outside now cuts it back up inside. Ball grinding. People that will still do it, I think. Scheduling is. It all starts next week. And we can't wait for it. Devontae Butler, going like this, hey, this is about ourselves, ourselves, as Jones keeps it, trying to get out people. Reps to the outside. And Joey Bosa getting to the, the outside is Jones, and he'll scoot right into the end zone for a touchdown. Obviously, defensively, they played well. They tackled well. Back on October 28th. 1950. Patrick Aiken's gonna take it. Aiken up at the 20, trying to get outside and no place. One, two, sprain. He said if he was an offensive line player, but he said, you know, if he's not ready to go. He's not ready to go. On the ground, they'll keep it. 